hair, it's, it's a, uh, in, in a way, it's a little bit different than cutting a, an adult's hair because the kids today like, like the, the, the real casual, more like the casual type of look, the surfer look, uh, the not that real kept look. It's more like a wash and wear type of haircut. But at the same time, you, you have to realize that it's changing. Is he, he understands how to keep his hair healthy because I've already talk, talked to him about how the hair health, right? We know what to do with our hair. Even though, what's your age? 12. You're 12 years old. So, the barbers today, when I mean, they're working with long hair on young kids, have to teach these kids how to take care of their hair in a healthier way. Uh, so when they come into the barber shop, you're working on really nice healthy hair. You're not working on something that hasn't been taken care of. He knows how to shampoo his hair correctly. He understands he needs to put oils in his hair. He understands all that because we've already had this conversation. So when he comes to me, I'm working on a nice canvas. I'm not working on a canvas that has a bunch of holes in it and I have to work with it to make it look good. So this is what's very unique, but again, it's the, uh, the, the teaching how to teach, how to teach these kids how to take care, care of their hair in a healthier way. So if you can't have a conversation with, with this young man at this age, well, I mean, when he becomes 20 or 23 years old, he still doesn't know how to shampoo his hair correctly. So you have to teach him at a younger age, and I, and I think this is where the, the barbering industry is losing it because we're not teaching the next generation. And so the, you have to teach the father, then the father will teach his, his kids if you're not doing kids. But you still have to teach the young kids how to take care of their hair in a proper way. Uh, and as you see, so he likes to carry his hair kind of a casual type of look, kind of a surfer type of look, easy to take care of. You know, shampoo, wash, and go, right? You don't need to try to make your hair look good. So it's a difference in in working with, say, a, uh, an adult. So, so you see he has these little curls here we were talking about earlier and some other, some of the haircuts. So I'm going to show you how to get rid of these little, these little curls and how to make it work. And the techniques are not too much, they're not too different. Um, like I said, the, the, the haircut itself has, has a blueprint. But instead of digging in, I'm not doing the deep tapers, I'm not doing this, I'm going more of a casual type of look. And as you can see, I'm leaving it kind of full. So it's not real tight. And we come in here because you see how these curls are right here like this. We kind of want to smooth that out just a little bit. So I'm going to take a razor to this one little area. And these areas that have that razor. And then in the back we'll clip it down just a little bit. So here we see we got that little curl right there. So we'll come in. Again, it's pulled the opposite direction. Like so. And you're just working in that one little area. Remember what I'm saying as to how you you take that 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 hair and you've extended it in the opposite direction. And when you're cutting because we don't want that curl to come out. And let's say we take that here and we pull it in the opposite direction. And now we're shaving it like so. See how see how this would see visualize this being a solid, and then this is it's cut down to that. So when it comes back, the cut is underneath, and it takes that curl off. Okay. Okay. 
here. Just turn your head this way. Hey, got rid of it.